What's up with the YouTube? It's Legit Sully back at you with another video. Man, I told y'all we over here doing big things on the channel, man. I told y'all I was going to start giving y'all that consistent content, you know, pushing out videos every day, man. If you hadn't already, go check out my last couple videos I did. You know, I did the, the, the A Mommy Near 3s. I'm, I'm definitely happy to have those in the collection. We did some unreleased early action on the channel, man. The the Georgetown Dunks, you know, go. those are expected to release. Hey, nobody knows. Um, the, the UNC dunk lows, the men's on release, those are expected to come out, you know, June 2021, maybe on July on um, time frame. But hey, that is the tentative release. But anyway, yeah, we got a real special, special video for y'all, man. If y'all seen a video I did, like, you know, about a week or two ago, I, I got a real dope trophy room shoe in the collection man and it was some issues with that video but you know i got it fixed and i, I um you were able to go watch that video but if you follow me on ig man you um i i posted a picture on, on of the of that of that shoe and i said you know my goal is to try to complete the set you know by the end of the year man and hey it's a far-fetched goal because hey you know some of these uh some of them on trophy room shoes got the friends and family pairs and things like that and and only friends and family can get them but hey you know maybe one day i'll become friends and family but anyway enough for all that let's go ahead and jump straight into the shoes man Oh man, here you go, man. You see it. You see the box. You know what shoe this is. This shoe has caused a lot of chaos, man. I remember when this shoe dropped, you know. Uh, and shout out to my guy Sheik's Closet, man. If you if you are um, following Sheik's Closet, you know that he posted a picture that had the whole sneaker community hot. Hey, like, man, how did he get all these pairs, man? Hey, man, you got to pay to play. That's how, that's all I got to say. You got to pay to play. But anyway, this release was kind of, you know, controversial because when, um, when, when they were originally going to release, you know, the suggested retail was, um, supposed to be 170. Then it changed to 190. It came out that a lot of pairs already had the suggested retail 170 price tag on them. A lot of the, um, uh, before they decided to make the change. So you got pairs that uh, has a 170 suggested retail price. You got pairs that got 190 suggested the retail price it's kind of crazy i know but hey you know things like that happen all the time within the sneak um within the, um you know the sneaker releases you know they um early on they decide on the price and they decide to you know change it but anyway y'all see the box the air jordan one trophy room box man and this is the air jordan one let's go ahead and read the label air jordan one retro high ogsp Colorway is white, black, varsity red, cell, size 11. And y'all see that this is one of the pairs that had the suggested U.S. retail price, 170 bucks. Let's go ahead and flip the lid. Bam, you see you got your lot. You got your Air Jordan Trophy Room. See, Trophy Room always does real dope touches on their boxes and when they do their releases. You got your lot number right there on the on underneath the lid. And let's go ahead and peel back the paper. So you got double layer um like little wax shoe paper. Then you got another layer of shoe paper. And here we go. Boom! Here we go, man. The Air Jordan 1 trophy room. Like they did you know come with like you know trophy room always hit us with with some nice things man so we got the you know it's like the ticket you know your ticket to the game man so you you got your ticket man on your ticket you got your address one trophy room it says open the ceremonies 1 p.m game time 145 and it has details on here like um your seat number your gate your section uh let's say event code trophy room you got a trophy room um logo right there and these are labeled do you know the freeze out these are being labeled the freeze out because during the um 85 um 
uh, uh, season, you know, Michael Jordan was selected to participate in the showcase and became the 36th rookie to garner a, a selection, you know. You know, several players decided they were freeze out him from the game, you know, because they didn't want no rookie coming into the, you know, the All-Star game shining. So, unfortunately, he only finished with like seven points. You know, he did two of nine shooting. It's probably like the, the one of one of his old, most horrible games he ever had because, you know, I, I got to go back and check. But, you know, he, he finished uh, only with seven points. You know, I'm not sure if that's the lowest points he ever scored in the game. But, yeah, that that's why these are labeled the freeze out. Let's get them out the box, man. Y'all like, shut up, Sully. Let's see the shoes, man. Let's see the shoes. So now we're taking the shoes out the box. Looking inside the box to see if there's any any uh, additional like labels or stickers in the box. There are, aren't any additional uh, things in the box, but oh, here we go, man. These are my first time having these in hand. So, and I thought this outsole was gray. It, I, I thought it was gray. I didn't know it was translucent. So you got that translucent outsole with your own uh, stars, you know. From from like the All Star game, you know, it's the red, the red, blue, you know, and then pretty much white um underneath, and, and you got that cream clear outsole, the midsole uh, wrapped all the way around. You got that sail colorway, and then moving on to the upper, you do got that Chicago color blocking on these. You have the the um heel tab, you know, with the with the uh, with the with the red, and then you have the your toe box. As well as um, you know, the, the the medial and the lateral side of the shoe coming up to the to the ankle collar, you do have in that, in that red colorway. You do have like that that that, that shiny. Seer. This is supposed to you know resemble like you know snow ice. You know because um you know you got that freeze out you know um, mentioned. So that's that's what that's why you got that real nice shimmery shiny look. You do have the um. You know Michael Jordan's um signature right there on your on your uh, lateral side of the uh, of the shoe. You have that black swoosh. You know you got that um you got your black wings logo. You got your white uh, tongue. You got your white tongue and yeah you got your and then on the inside of the tongue it says February tenth um. 1985 that was the date of the all-star game and inside of the shoe you got your red you got your red um insole and it says air jordan with the trophy room on um, logo and on the shoe you it says rumor has it you know rumor has it that they froze him out you know they, they say they didn't you know people saying that he wasn't froze out you know they just was playing you know the game but everybody uh, all these years later, it's still speculation that, he, that, that there has been a freeze out. Now, here is your left shoe. They do come with additional laces. Now, this is not the friends and family pair. Everybody knows the friends and family pair came with the blue laces. And it's crazy because they are selling um, just the laces on eBay for like crazy, stupid numbers, man. But anyway, uh, put it in the comments below, man. Let me know what y'all think, man. But like I always say, tomorrow is not promised, so take advantage of today. Until next time, it's Legit Sully. I'm out of here.